Hello everybody, welcome to my videos. So it's been brought to my attention that people have not been able to edit their models without re-uploading in the new warehouse. I've already, I understand I've already made a video showing you how to edit a model in the old warehouse. That video is no good, so chances are that video is going to be disappearing. But this new video will show you how to edit in a new in the new warehouse because well that's the new warehouse and the old warehouse is obviously gone alright so what it shows here is some warehouse models um, I will find whichever ones are my name and like I'll pick one say whichever one is under my name pick one that I want to edit so I'm just in the warehouse, not logged in or anything. Then I'll find it. Say, for example, I want to do something with this house. Um, maybe it's a color that I don't like. Or maybe it's something else that I don't like. And I want to change it. Maybe a window's not right. Who knows? So here's the model, obviously. And what I want to do is, I want to edit this model. Alright, so it is one of my models. Because you can't edit another person's model without, you know, I mean, unless you're not a collaborator, so you can edit your own. So go up here to the upper right, click sign in. Then it'll prompt you to sign in. You'll sign in with your password. Click sign in. Give it a second. Alright, so as you see now, here on the upper right, it'll show that you're signed in. It'll show your little picture, your icon, and your username. And then, alright, so look at the column on the right. The red button that says download. As you're signed in, say download. And you'll get some choices. You'll get like, you know, SketchUp, whatever version. And then you'll have the Google Earth. Uh, for the record, don't click on Google Earth. I mean, it doesn't do anything for you that's useful. And you'll see, you'll use the version you have that you use latest. For me, it's the 2014 model that I've used. I mean, usually you'll see that if you've edited the model or uploaded the model ever since the new warehouse came to be. If you didn't, if it wasn't before the new warehouse, chances are you'll see two choices like 2008, no, I mean, like SketchUp 8 or SketchUp 7 or SketchUp 6 and so on. So just click on the version that you use the latest. So I'm going to click on the 2014 because that's what I used when I uploaded this. And then down at the bottom, it will tell you, do you want to run or save? Just say open. Just click open. And it will give this. Start using SketchUp. And so you are right here in the model. It opened the model for you. Now what I want to do is I want to retain this image. So what I want to do is... You don't have to do this. You can change your image. I mean, because it will change. I don't want mine to change. So I'm going to do that. That's just me. If I have shadows, I want to remove them so the model doesn't get slow. So you can go into the model, obviously. Now let's see what needs changing. Ah, yes. These walls. I hate these walls. For the record, let's change those. 
see what they are. Material 11. Well, we're going to change this. different color and I want a white I like white for this so it's on material so I mean whatever changes you desire you know I mean be it a color or be it that you need a race or something you can do whatever you want like I mean or even add layers transfer so on, so forth, whatever you want. Oh, and you know, I want this door to be changed as well. So, I mean, you can see I'm doing whatever I want. There, I did whatever I wanted. Now it's time to re-upload the model. Well, we're not going to re-upload, we've only edited the model. Oh yeah, before you go, just make sure everything is in order. Because I know how annoying it is whenever I go back and see things that I've missed, so... Ensure. It never hurts to double check. Ever. Or triple check. Or me, like when I leave for work, I have to shake my door often. So I'll just delete this, because, yeah, just like that. And then, alright, so say you're done with all your changes. You go to Share Model, up at the upper right. I'll have the little box with the green arrow. If it will. I'm sorry, my internet sucks tonight, so uh, it's a little slow, but hopefully yours isn't. Okay, so here it will ask you to sign in again. Do it. Alright, then just sign in. Wait for it. Alright, so as you can see, the description is still there, the name is still there, all your tags are still there. Just go down to the lower left and go update. Uh, just wait for it. Um, I did two things to my model just because I felt like it. Alright, so read at the top, it'll say success. Your model has been uploaded. Please note that it can take a minute or so, blah, 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 blah. As long as you see that success, you're good. So you can either just close out of that, and then the upper right, sign out on that. It's signing you out. All right, so you're back to that page. Now you can, on the model, just click the X, save changes to house. I usually do, so I'm just going to go yes. And then here, it'll take you all the way back to the original page. It's already changed, so just sign out. Because you already saw success, so... And then, still at the upper right, you'll see this. Sign out as well. I just do that so then it doesn't get so I don't confuse myself whenever I want to sign in again later because sometimes it will sometimes it won't who knows all right everybody hope you enjoyed it I hope this was helpful for you if you did please rate comment subscribe I'd really appreciate it and uh, thank you for watching have a great day all right goodbye